This is my third time making a video like this, and hopefully it'll be the last, because when I initially announced this project, I promised a release date of 2016. Either time flies way too fast, or I'm extremely lazy and procrastinistic. Probably both. <laughs> Welcome to Ebert's team. Hello, I'm Nathan. I'm the guy who runs this channel. I know, it's been about like 84 years since you've seen this face, and it is not a pretty sight. But anyways, let's just jump into what I was going to talk about in this video. Voice acting. So a while back, I said I needed voice actors for my animated projects, and I still do. And actually, now that I got new plans and directions that I want these projects to go, I actually need them now more than ever. So if you're new to this channel, you probably don't know what projects I am even talking about. Well, basically, there are three projects that I'm currently working on and I need voice actors for. Angry Birds Team Toon Season 4, The Pig Bad Plan, Adventures of Lego Minecraft Season 4, and my newest endeavor, Angry Tale. As you can tell, a lot of these projects revolve around stories and properties that are pretty outdated at this point, but I promise you that with your help, I will make them exciting and interesting again upon the release, which hopefully will be this fall or winter of this year, uh, if not summer of the next. I'm sorry, okay? You know, animation takes a really long time. So what are each of these projects about? Well, I'll have a more detailed and in-depth description for each of them in the sign-up sheets that are linked in the description, but now I'll just briefly uh, summarize a little bit about each one. Angry Birds Team Tunes, The Pig Bad Plan, is about a young, anxiety-filled scientist who's torn between helping his friends or going for the girl of his dreams, even though he doesn't even think she likes him that much. Adventures of Lego Minecraft Season 4 is about a young hacker who thinks he can just steal and cheat his way in order to get to the top. And Angry Tail? Well, Angry Tail is basically going to be the original Undertale storyline, but told with angry birds and pigs instead of monsters and humans. Except this time it's going to be like a movie, and so that's kind of why I need voice actors for it. If you've been living under a rock your entire life and somehow don't know anything about the Undertale storyline, please pause this video and Google Undertale True Pacifist Storyline. Trust me, you'll find something really, really interesting and fun. So yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing, and if you're at all interested in hearing yourself in the shoes of these characters, I highly encourage you to click the links down in the description and uh, sign up. Alright, now on to the technical stuff. So because I already have most of the cast for Adventure of LEGO Minecraft put together from Season 3, the only characters I really need for that project are just the side characters that don't really have a name. But, but, that does not mean that you are any less important. In fact, it actually means that you are more important because because I need background characters, otherwise, you know, the scene just looks weird and awkward because no one's there. Also, if you sign up for a player character, then um, you can actually have your Minecraft skin, uh, if you still play Minecraft, that is, put onto a LEGO Minecraft minifigure, so, you know, that's a plus. Right now, I think I should also mention that you can sign up for multiple characters if you really want to, uh, but just keep in mind that since this is going to be stricter and more professional than any other projects that I I have done, you may end up either getting a character you didn't want to initially voice act, or maybe not any character at all. Like I said, it's not because I hate you, it's just that I'm trying to find the perfect voice and the perfect actor to portray these characters. So once I do end up finishing the scripts and storyboards and technical stuff like that, this is how auditions are going to go. If you signed up, I'm going to send you a couple of lines from that character slash characters that you chose, and some minimalistic direction because I'm just trying to see what you guys think would be best for the character and you know how you guys would portray um, This said character best in your own mind. Then I'm gonna look through my emails and then the ones I like are gonna um, End up getting a direct message on one of the contact sites that I'm going to mention later and with that I'll move on to my next point quality I, for one, know that high-quality recording equipment is extremely expensive, and it's really hard to find something that's actually good. Heck, I'm recording this on a probably outdated phone uh, in a room that I rarely get to be at with terrible green screen experience. I mean, look at these little fuzzies around me. 
It's so bad. But if you really want to be part of this, there are a few requirements that you need in order to even be considered for a part. Number one, you need a quiet room with no background noise, including air vents, uh, people talking, or loud pets, or any just loud, distracting sounds in the background. Two, I need to clearly be able to hear and understand your voice without anything like glitches, pauses in the audio randomly, or, you know, lag, or, you know, any sort of weird fuzzy background noise or anything like that, you know, etc, etc. And three, I probably should have mentioned this before, but you need to have either a Skype, uh, Google Hangouts, or Discord account. This is because if you do actually end up getting the part, I need to be able to communicate with you and direct you while you're doing the voice acting, so I'm not just sending emails just back and forth. So I guess another requirement, uh, number four, would be an open schedule where you can have recording sessions sessions for a um, long time, so basically any time you are um, free during you know, um, a day or a time or whatever, and make sure you actually are free uh, for a couple of hours um, on end because these recording sessions, um, like I said, are going to be a lot more professional and so they're going to take a lot longer time. So yeah, have an open schedule because that will really help. If you've worked in voice act for me in the past, you would know that I usually give minimal direction when it comes to recording sessions. I just tell you to say the line, uh, then I take it and edit it a little bit, and that's it. That That's good. But this time is going to be extremely different. In fact, it's going to feel a lot more like a real studio setting. I might stop you mid-line or tell you to say something over and over again, and at times it might actually seem like I'm yelling at you, but um, trust me, I am not. I actually really appreciate you. Yeah, I just want the best for these projects, and you know, that might mean uh, having you say a monologue five times in a row just so I can get different um, variations of that line and you know just so I can have all sorts of different directions and approaches to the attitude of that character and that line. So yeah, that's that and I just want you know to let you guys know what you're getting into if you decide to um, sign up for this. Alright, I've talked on for some time now, let's talk about you guys. So what will you get if you sign up? Well, besides credit in the video and description, I actually haven't thought of anything. I'm sorry, I was going to offer up money, but that isn't really an option right now for the position that I am currently in with that sort of stuff. And, you know, with people being able to sign up from all over the world, there comes, you know, troubles with the whole, you know, transferring currency thing and the whole mail over the borders and all this different, you know, complicated different country stuff. And it's just, it's just a big, ginormous, complicated process that I don't really want to get involved with um, right now. But I will think of something and I will um, give it to you guys if you sign up. So yeah, that is pretty much all I have to say. If you somehow made it to the end of this video, be sure to head to the links either in the description or I might try to put them in the card if that's possible. And so uh, yeah, that is pretty much it for this video guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. This is Nathan from the Angry Birds team and I will see you guys later. Goodbye! Aww.